An organisation that helps homeless people living in Sydney's CBD claims it's being targeted unfairly after being issued with three parking fines in recent weeks. While the City Council says police are only doing their job, it's now looking at ways to solve the problem. Parsadon has been giving out clothes to those less fortunate for nearly six years. It's got busier now. Now the trend is on the street, you're seeing people with uh, beds on the street. But in recent weeks, police have been passing on fines to the organisation. You're parked here in a no-stopping zone. Correct. You're breaching the law. OK, I'm giving you... I'm going to issue a ticket. Not once, but three times. Thank you. You will be receiving an individual notice for parking on my place. Oh, will we? Yes. OK. It's an offence to park the vehicle on the footpath in Martin Place. Yeah. That's why it's being moved on. Costing them nearly $800. And a number of providers um, of services to the homeless community have been targeted with fines for doing nothing more than quietly setting up shop in Martin Place. Now, the main issue boils down to this. On Phillips Street down here, most of these spots are reserved for our state politicians. While further down, there are next to no car spots, giving operators little to no choice. All we're doing here is trying to help people. Um, there's not a lot of people around at this time of night. Seven News contacted the Premier and Police Minister's office, who referred us to the City of Sydney Council. They say police are simply doing their job and are now investigating ways that can help mobile voluntary services safely and respectfully, with at least one of the fines now being challenged in court. Just let us continue to help people. Matthew Carstunen, 7 News.